today is the wrap up of the week. So I took something from every um, day and I put it in there. Um, so have some weights close by. We will pull them in if you have them. If not, it's okay. Um, and I did modify a couple moves, make them a little different for today. But that's it. Four circuits, four, three rounds each, four moves, and they are 40 seconds on, 10 seconds off. Have a lovely, lovely workout. Let's move together on this Friday. Let's get started. I'm going to back up gracefully. I think that was a Pantani sisters move. <laughs> it's like. <laughs> Okay, let's go, let's go. Squeeze that booty, shoulders down our back. Big deep breath in. Friday vibes. My Friday vibes are chill today. <laughs> One more. And big arm circles back. Open up that chest. Squeeze those shoulder blades together. Two, one, and reverse. Forward, now scoop out. Anything that's blocking your way, get it out of there. Get it out of there. One more, big open arms, open that chest up and hug. Hug, 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 hug. Oh, hugging you, step big and wide and big hip circles. Ooh, send that booty. Oh wow, all the way back. Grab those hammies when you're back there, oh yeah. Other way, shoulders away from your ears. Mine were just all like up there having a party. One more, beautiful, let's hug a leg in. Hug it in, release, hug it in, release. One more each side, hug it in, press it over. Hug it in, press it over, and then give yourself some quad stretches. One, nice and easy, just to release. Lengthening the muscle, releasing it. One more each side. Good job. Give me one big step out. Side lunge. Reach, reach, reach. Come back up to center. Other side. Reach, navel to spine. Good. Give me a little jog. A little jog. Excuse me as I <laughs> did some weird, awkward thing with my nose. Okay, I'm going to show you the first moves. We are working our lower body. So we are doing, we did this with bands this week. Keep jogging in place. We did. Had our arms up at 90 wide, medium, narrow, up. So we're gonna do the same thing. I don't have any weights in my hands this time and no band around my legs. So we're, that's our move number one. Move number two, do have weights close by. You are hitting a sumo deadlift. We did this yesterday. Toes are pointed out, you're pressing into the ground and you come up and squeeze at the top. That's move number two. Keep jogging. Number three, we're going down to the ground. Instead of that donkey, we did a donkey. We are gonna just do bird dog, okay? So you are alternating arm, leg, and reach. Navel to spine, shoulders down your back. That's move number three. Then we're turning it over. Have your weights in your hand. And we're doing a bridge press out. So that's it. Get ready for your big wide sumos. I mean, not sumos, big wide squats. Arms are up, here we go. Wide, medium, narrow, up, other side, wide, medium, narrow, up. I want you staying as low as you can through those three squats. Those three variations in length of your squat. Keep that chest up, squeeze that booty at the top. Wide, narrow, medium, up, shoulders down your back. I love 40 second rounds. They're only 10 seconds shorter than a 50 but feels like a world of a different time. Finish this move out. Beautiful, have those weights close by. We're doing that deadlift, hitting our lower body. So sumo, wider than shoulder width, toes are pointed out, shoulders down your back, slight bend in knee, booty goes back, press into the ground to come up. Slight bend in that knee, booty goes back, back is nice and straight, has that neutral flow. There's a little curve in it but your head stays neutral. Shoulders stay down your back. Breathe. I love that we're going on the floor in the first circuit. And some beautiful moves. The bird dog, anybody has lower back issues? The bird dog is one of your best friends. Press that ground away, squeeze that booty at the top. Finish this last move. Time. 
put those weights just next to you. We are going into our bird dog. So come on into all fours, quadruped, hands directly below shoulders, knees directly below hips, hip width apart, opposite hand, opposite leg, reach back down. You are not moving your hips. You are not moving your hip, meaning your hips aren't dipping, they navel to spine, reach. Squeezing that booty, finding length in your spine, keeping your head completely neutral. Work to keep that navel to spine. It's Debbie's birthday, Scorpio power. I fear the Scorpio, I have to be honest. Time, turn it over. Like, I think you have powers. My sister just screwed me and she scares me so fast. <laughs> the arms are up. Here we go. Press, open, back, down. I mean, I love her to death. Oh my girl. Press up, press out those knees. Those hands are pressing up with those weights in them. Squeeze. Good job, good job, good job. Keep going. Press that booty up. Press those legs out. Come back down. See so how we're doing this without a band? Totally fine. Good job. Come back up to the top. Move those weights out into a nice safe space. And we got our squats again. Your arms come in at a 90 degree angle outside, out in front. And we go. Wide, medium, narrow, up. Other side, wide, medium, narrow. You know what? Go up to toes. Wide, stay low the whole time. Wide, medium, narrow, up. Wide, medium, narrow, up. My legs are burning already. <laughs> Accumulation of a week. Work. Good job, keep going. Keep going, so close. Two, one, up. Sumo deadlift. Toes point slightly out. Wider than your shoulders. Slight bend in that knee. Here we go. Send that booty back. Keep those eyes up, beautiful Jen. Yes, Michelle. Navel is fine, squeeze it at the top. Press into the ground to come up. Oh my God, gorgeous, Debbie. Shana, your forehead looks amazing. <laughs> my body laughs, you're crushing it. Jana, I have to start the series all over. Like I watched it, there's nothing else on television. Nothing. <laughs> Press the ground away. I mean, there's a lot of amazing television on. I just can't pay attention to anything that doesn't have Jamie Fraser at a time. Bird dog, because I have a problem and I accept that. I'm just living with it. <laughs> Here we go, bird dog, press out and back in. Make sure you are lined up, meaning your navel is just fine. Hands directly under elbows, directly under shoulders. Foot presses straight back, hands straight forward. <sighs> This is, there's no speed. This round is not about speed. It is about control of your movement. Time. Over on your back, arms up in the air. You're hitting a bridge, holding those arms up. Here we go. Open, uh, open, press up, press out with your knees. Back down in control. Shoulders away from your ears. Squeeze. Good job, keep going. Press it out. Three, two, one. 
Good job. Back up. We're going through this one more time. And that is the wide squat, medium squat, narrow squat, arms up in a 90. Here we go. Wide, medium, narrow. If you could hit the toes, go for it. Wide, medium, narrow. And your toes are forward. It's not a sumo squat. Stay low. Oh. Good job, good job, good job. Keep going. Oh. Also, is anyone else affected by the time change? I can't keep my eyes open. Time past like 9.30, 9.45. I'm like lights out. Time, time, time. We got our single deadlift. And it's kind of ridiculous. Okay, here we go, sumo deadlift. You are breathing the entire time. Shoulders are down your back. Micro bend in those knees, do not forget that. Helps activate those leg muscles to get very involved in getting you back upright. Arms stay close to legs as you go down that, as you lower, as you hinge. Press that booty back. I'm like, is it the time change or am I just getting old? <laughs> My legs are out by 10. Time for a dog. Hands directly under shoulders, line this baby up, knees directly under hips, and you are reaching back in, keeping that head completely neutral. It does not dip, it does not look up. And that navel to spine is very, very important. Pressing the ground away when your hands are down. Good job, good job. Here's your tip for the last, always going through on the last time. Turn it over. If you don't have weights, you can use a towel and pull it for resistance in your hands in this next move in the bridge prep with your arms up. Here we go. Bridge, press out, back down. And as you are pressing into the ground, that bird dog, I want you pressing up with your arms. Press it. And I also want you to squeeze your toes. You're breathing. Do not hold your breath. Good job, keep going. You've got 10 seconds. Time. Let me confirm I did not F up. I did not. We are good. Circuit one is done. You have three circuits left. We are going into our core circuit next. Good job, everybody. Take a sip of water. You've got about 30 seconds. Then I'll show you our nuggets from the week that we're doing today. So this is a good circuit. Um, we're pulling from Tuesday, from Monday, and from yesterday. So we got our high plank. Oh my God, just made a huge mess. Let me bring you down the ground with me. Okay, first move, we have that high plank. Knee to elbow, knee crosses, leg extends through, back to the beginning, okay? And then you do the other side. Hold on, timer. And then we have our, we did this. If you wanted to do it with a weight, you can put it in your hand. We didn't do it with a weight on Tuesday. Single leg, knee up, okay? Forward facing. That's move number two. Yesterday, in honor of basic training, boot camp, and our veterans, we did our army crawl. So you are in low plank and you are crawling. Okay, I want that butt down the whole time. You go forward, you go back. Keep your booty down. If it goes up, it's getting electrocuted. Okay, and then we have, we did this on Tuesday arms out, legs up, rainbows, or windshield wipers. So you do need windshield wipers, it is raining. Okay, here we go. Let's go, first move, high plank. 
knee to same elbow, cross it to extend. Here we go. Knee to same elbow, cross it, extend, and back. Same elbow, cross it, extend. Bring it back. If that extension feels very strange, you could stop at that cross elbow and just bring that leg back. It's totally fine. <sighs> Keep that butt down. Keep. Good job. Give me one more rep. <sighs> Time. Flip it over. We have that single leg. I'm going to grab a weight. We have a single leg via. So back, up. Oh my goodness. Good job, everybody. Keep going. Keep those shoulders down your back. You are reaching straight forward for that leg that's coming up. Time. We have our army crawl. Get ready in that low plank. Low plank. If you want to just crawl, bear crawl, you can do that too. And you are moving forward. You are looking where you're going. And then you come back. Go legs forward, four or five. Keep that booty down. Keep that core tight. My arms are lit up, as is my core. Navel to spine, navel to spine, navel to spine. Three, two, one. Windshield wipers or rainbows. On your back, arms out to the side. You're like in a T or an LT <laughs> because your legs are up. Lower back is on the mat. Then you're, as you go to one side, your one hip is going to have to come off the mat. That is fine. Keep your shoulders on the mat. Those do not come off. So you might be limited to your spinal rotation, and that is fine. Listen to your body. Don't let gravity pull those legs down to the ground. You pull them back up. And fight to keep those shoulders down. Time. Beautiful. Good job. High plank. Knee to same elbow. Cross it, then extend it if you can. Here we go. Keep that head neutral. Make sure your arms are lined up. Knee, elbow, extend. Keep that core totally engaged. Good job, everybody. Keep going. You got three, two, one. On your back. If you have that weight, grab it. Single leg, V up. Here we go. I want control in your ascension and as you go back and be set to the ground. Control. Good job, good job, good job. Again, weight is not necessary. Good, Allison. Yes, Debbie, beautiful. Go, Lindsay. Oh my God, gorgeous. Time. Oh wow, that was really, really beautiful. Okay, low plank, army crawl. Here we go. Three, two, one, hit it. 
stay low, keep that head neutral, but you are looking forward to see where you're going. Keep that butt down. If you come out and look, like if your butt comes up, that is gonna take it less out of your core and put it all in your shoulders. So really get that booty down and squeeze. It should be uncomfortable. In like, oh, this is hard, uncomfortable. Two, one. Good job. Windshield wipers, rainbows, however you wanna look at. Maybe we need a windshield wiper to look at the rainbow. Here we go. You are breathing the entire time here. Do not hold your breath. As those legs go down, then you have to pull back up. Continuous cycle of breath. Focus on it. It will relax you. Try and keep those shoulders down. Definitely keep those hands down. Your shoulders are going to move a little bit, but not much. Keep going. Time. Good job. We're going back to the top. Great. Yes, high plank. Okay, didn't forget anything. Rebecca, I did good. I didn't forget anything yesterday. Let's go. Knee, cross it, extend, line yourself up. You're over, hands, elbow, shoulder, booty down, neutral spine, knee to elbow, knee to opposite elbow. Extend. Beautiful. Keep that core totally engaged. Yes, you're almost there. You got five seconds. Give you one more rep. Time. Just grab that weight if you want. Single leg V up. Reaching for that leg. Here we go. Oh. <laughs> Oh, 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 my core is working. Time. Army crawl. I kind of love the army crawl because it's pretty intense. Okay, here we go. Hit it. Get that foot down. Keep your body so low. Not so low like you're doing a solo number, but so low. L O W. Happy birthday, Debbie! We're crawling to you! We're gonna make it! Squeeze that core. You are almost there. Three, two, one. Time. I know, we did it. We all made it to Debbie's house. We're there, Debbie. <laughs> okay, windshield wiper rainbow time. Here we go. <sighs> Breathing the entire time. I find that I like to hold my breath on this. <sighs> keep going, keep going. Continuous breath. Get that. Right when I go towards the ground, before that, when I hit that pause, come back up, that's where I like to hold my breath. But I'm going to focus on not doing that. Time, time. I did it way again, two times in a row. Circuit two is done. Grab your 30 seconds and run with it. Actually just recover with it. 
we're going into, you know, my fave cardio. But I will say, yesterday was such a cardio beast that I picked my nice and fun cardio rather than my horrible, devastating cardio. Because I still want to have fun today. Like it's Friday. <laughs> I don't want to be. I don't want to be recovering all day. Okay, here we go. So it's our friendly cardio, and it looks like this. Four moves. We have, oh, this was good. This was yesterday. This was yesterday. Grab a pillow. If you have it, you don't need it. If you don't have it, it's fine. We, our toes are forward. They're shoulder width apart, a little wider. Forward, though. You are reaching down here. Oh, I have to grab this pillow, bring it up, and oh, I have to slam it on the other side. So you're rotating the top of your part of your body. It's another trunk twist. And if you want to grab some air in the middle, go for it. That's your first move, a pillow slam. Okay. Second move is, what did we have here? Wind sprints. We did this. Oh, we did this yesterday too. So just run, tap the ground, run it back. That's move number two. Move number three. I don't I think we did this Tuesday, Monday or Tuesday. I think we did Tuesday. You are walking out. You are popping or walking those legs in, jumping up, hands down. Pop or walk those legs back. Come on. Jump at the back side. Last move. We have that lateral shuffle with that head knee knee thrust. Okay. So those aren't those aren't split lunges. Let's hit it. Wind sprints. Oh no! Wait. Overtake. Run ahead. Run ahead. Run ahead. This one. Let's go. Grab it. You're here for forty seconds. It's not a Tabata. So. Sorry, my husband is <laughs> Keep that one. I'm gonna lessen my slam. Now, you are at 15 seconds. Keep going. Three, two, one. Nice, Lindsay. Nice, Jen. Get ready for your wind sprints. Here we go. Run, tap the ground. So I found that if I start back here, I have more space and I go diagonal. So optimize your space for length. Keep going, get that booty down when you tap the ground. Yes, go Jen, go Allison. Go Betsy. Oh my God, it's funny to watch. We all look like we have somewhere really important to go. Go, go time. Oh my God, that was amazing. Time, 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 time. We're walking out. We're walking out, let's go. Walk it out. You can walk or pop those legs in. Up to toes or jump. Hands back down. Pop it back. Up to toes or jump. Keep going. Oh my God, that was amazing. I might have to do a little video of that. <laughs> time, 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 time. Get ready for your lateral shuffle with that knee, hand, head, hip, good knee thrust. Here we go. I want to shoulder turn it back. You can get lower. You can stay high. That lateral movement is great for running legs, walking legs. Good job, good job, keep going. Two. 
two, one. Good job. We're back at the top. We have those overhead pillow slams. You remember it's 40 seconds, not 20 seconds. Let's go. So side up. You can go in the air at the top or not. Really grab that core as you're slamming. Keep going. You got this. Two, one. All right. Guys, we all have some place to go. That's why we're going to wind sprint our way there. In three, two, one, go. <laughs> Keep going, keep going. <laughs> Everybody's got some place to go. go. <laughs> oh my God, it's amazing. Tap that ground. You've under 15 seconds to get where you're going. So get there. Time, you're there, you made it with time to spare. We have our walkout. We're walking it out. Now that we're there, we're walking out. All right, here we go. Walk it out, pop it in, up to toes, or jump. Hands down, pop it back. Good job, everybody. Good job. Keep going. You're almost there. You're almost there. Time. Time. Lateral shuffle. Knee thrust. In three, two, hit it. Drive that knee up. Constant movement is cardio. Keep going. You got six seconds. Time. Time. Last time through cardio. Grab your pillow. Time to have a pillow fight. Let's go. Over top. Slam it down. You can go toes. You can go air. Slam that baby down. You're almost there. You got five. You got three. You got three. Guys, party's over. It's now time to run home, okay? So get ready. Go! Practically getting home. Here we go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. We're gonna be late, we're gonna be late. I think I wanna go for a run tomorrow. You got this. Come on. You got it. less than 10. Ah. Time. Time. Okay. 
you're home. Now we gotta walk out at home. Three, two, one, walk it out. Pop those legs in, pop it up. Hands down, back with your feet, walk it back. Last one is Tabata. Time. Time. Lateral knee thrust. In three, two, one, go. Mm. Shoulders down your back. Navel the spine. Mm. You got this. Keep going. Mm. Keep moving. Keep moving. Mm. Yes. Keep going, keep going, you're almost there. Three, two, one, done. Cardio is done. Good job, good job. Good old ticker health. Keep that ticker in order. And your lungs, we have upper body. Upper body is what is left of our time together today. So if you have weights, it's we're gonna use them if you got them. If not, it's okay. I'll show you the moves. Yesterday, we did a momentum military press. So you will be loaded at your shoulders. You will have a three quarters of a, you're going into a squat. So you're in a high squat. You're not gonna do a squat, but you're looking like it. And then you press. Up, you burst up with energy. You know what, let's just do it. Let's get going. I'll show you the next move when we get there. So, remember, you can totally use those legs. I want you to use those legs to help you press up. If it's too much with weights, you take the weights out or go lighter, hold a towel. Press it up. Your elbows are slightly in front of your shoulders, you're not sticking them straight out to the side. Three, two, one, beautiful. We are hitting the ground. We have a single leg push up, okay? So we just did a push, press up. Now we're gonna do push. Here we go, let's hit it. Single leg, lift one leg up, press that ground away. You can do this on the wall. You could do it with a knee down. Lift one leg up. Okay, totally fine. Remember we're here for 40. It's not a 20. Listen to your body. Did you have a crazy workout week? Is your body tired? Listen to it. Time, beautiful. Okay, we are going on our backs. We're hitting a hollow hold. So it's a little bit of a whole total body here. But we did this chest fly. We did it on Wednesday. Let's get into it. Arms are out to the side. And you have legs open, closed. I don't have any weights in my hand because I didn't bring my light ones out. So open and close. If you have light weights, put them in your hands. Open and close. So we're working our chest. And I threw in a little extra core. You're welcome. Lower back on the mat. Two, one. Beautiful. Oh, this is nice. We're going into a high plank. I want you to lift one leg and then put yourself into a down dog with that leg up in the air. Okay? So if you don't want to do the 
You could just do the downward dog. That's totally fine. Otherwise, you come into that high plank, you lift one leg, you press the ground away, press back. So this is in your shoulders now. Lift the other leg. And as always, core is here. We can give her a name, we just call her Cora. Oh, Cora's here again. Or Corey. Everyone, Corey, you stay able to join. That was fun. We're back at your friend Corey so sweet. Time. Those are your four moves. Back up to the press. Here we go. Rack on your shoulders, little bend, press. Keep those shoulders away. I gotta fix my camera. It's like you're looking at my knees. Away from your ears. Keep going. You have that bend in your knee, and then you sink slightly deeper. Press up. Time. Beautiful. I can't remember what second. Oh, single leg push up. That's why I was trying to block it from my memory. Let's go. Here we go. Leg comes up. Press that ground away. Alternate the leg. You want to go for speed here? You do it. You do you. I'm going for in control. Everybody go. Yes, beautiful. Yes, yes. Three, two, one. Gorgeous on your back. You have light weights, you can put them in your hands. We have that open and close with your legs and the chest fly. So legs open, chest, arms open, close. Pressing that lower back into the mat, okay? You're breathing, your shoulders are down your back. Oh, good job. If you have to put your head down, if there's a tremendous amount of stress on your neck, go ahead, put your head down. It's okay. But make sure your back stays on the mat. So you might have to lift your legs up to come up higher. You're coming out of a hollow and that's fine. I want to form, form, time, time. This is our last one. Wow, because it's a down dog lady session. Here we go. So you are in high plank, you raise one leg, you press through your fingers and your shoulders, come back into high plank. Beautiful, raise the other leg, press back. Come back into that beautiful high plank. Again, this is not speed. Keep going. Keep that spine neutral. Time. Back up that last round through. Military press. What, here we go. Last time through. Nice little bend in your knees. Navel spine. Squeeze that booty at the top. Big exhale as you press those weights up. Good job. Breathing and pressing. Pressing and breathing. Using those legs. I don't often say that when we do upper body, but here we can. Strong wrist. Time, beautiful. Put those babies out to the side. Single leg push up. Here we go. You got this. Hit it. 
elbows go 45 degrees back. Keep those hips square to the ground. Press the ground away. Last time, under a Tabata. Get that core involved. Press that ground away. Time. Good job. On your back. That hollow with the open and closing of arms. Here we go. When we did this, I think it was Tuesday. I think I had three pounders in my hand. So, I mean, very little weight you could use here. Oh. And then I adjust. Lower back wasn't stayed on the mat, so I have to adjust my situation. Energy in those legs as you press them together. Pretend you have that resistance band on. Oh, we did this Wednesday because we have a band on. Time. Last time, last move, last move, last move. We have that down dog. High plank, leg lift, down dog. Here we go, leg lift. Pressing the ground away. Articulate that spine back in. Leg lift. Press into the ground through your hands, through your fingers, and that leg travels up with you. If you are uncomfortable being in that tripod configuration, put your leg on the ground and just do a down bow. You're still hitting your shoulders. Drive through your hips into that down dog. Press into the ground and you're done. Put those knees wide, hands out in front, and you're hitting that child's pose. Let's go right into it. Oh, really reach through your fingertips. Beautiful, walk it. Walk it to one side. Oh my goodness, grabbing all those beautiful muscles on the side of your body. Sending that booty back. Walk it through to the other side. <sighs> breathing, breathing, breathing. Come back to neutral. Come right back to center. I want you to take one arm, sew it through under your armpit. Let your head rest on the ground. Let your body weight rest on that shoulder. And reaching with that top arm and reaching with that bottom arm. Beautiful, come back through. Other side, thread the needle underneath. Grab with those fingers, both of them. You're reaching over the top of your head and you're reaching out through the side. You feel your shoulder blades come apart and stretch. And you should feel the weight helping from your head, really, your heavy head. Helping stretch that shoulder. Deep breath in. Exhale, unthread that needle. Back into one more child, so send that booty back. Come up into that quadruped and hit that cat. Tuck your chin, tuck your tailbone, and reverse it. It's beautiful, fine neutral. Curl the toes under. Lift that booty, hips go up into the air, and we are hitting a down dog with both feet on the ground, pressing into the ground with your fingertips. Hips going up to the ceiling, heels driving into the ground. Inhale, and as you exhale, walk your legs and hands together. Just shake your head, no. No, nice little extra stretch. Yes. And roll it up. Roll it, roll it, roll it. Shoulders down. Oh, one big deep breath in. It's Friday. 
Thank you for being with me. I'm officially saturated. It's lovely to see your faces and I look forward to seeing them again on Monday if I'm so lucky. Smile and win sprint wherever you're going this weekend, okay? Just run there. <laughs> Bye, you guys. Have a fun weekend. <laughs> Thank you so much.